Hi all, this is Sampath. In the today video tutorial, I am going to show organization structure in SAP MM. The client is highest hierarchical level in the SAP system and it represents the corporate group. Best consultant is responsible to create client. And a client is defined in SAP system by a three digit numeric key. Company code is the smallest organizational unit in external accounting, for which a complete self contained bookkeeping system can be maintained. Company code tracks all accounting postings and creates a complete audit trail for balance sheets and profit and loss statements. FSEO consultant is responsible to create company code. Company code consists of four digit either numeric or alphanumeric key. Plant is the organization unit within logistics. It subdivides the enterprise from the viewpoints of production, procurement, plant maintenance, and material planning. Plant represents the various entities within a company such as manufacturing facility, central issuing storage location, regional sales office, corporate headquarters, and maintenance location. SAP MM consultant is responsible to create plant, and plant consists of four digit either numeric or alphanumeric key. Storage location is an organizational unit within a plant, and storage location is responsible for manage inventory. And quantity basis. In SAP, MM consultant is responsible to create storage location and it consists four digit either numeric or alphanumeric key. Purchase organization is the organizational unit within logistics and purchase organization is responsible for purchasing activities. In SAP, MM consultant is responsible to create purchase organization and purchasing organization consists four digit either numeric or alphanumeric key. Purchase group is the organizational unit. Purchase group represent a buyer or group of buyers responsible for purchasing activities. In SAP, MM consultant is responsible for create purchasing group. And purchase group consists three digit either numeric or alphanumeric key. Now we can see assignment of various organization structures in SAP MM. We can create n number of company codes within the client. In SAP, there is no need to assign company code to client separately. Once you create the plant, we must and should assign plant to company code. One plant we can assign to only one company code. That means one plant belongs to only one company code. But one company code can have multiple plants. We can create a number of storage location within the plant. Same key we can use to create in another plant. For example, we have 1000 and 1100 plant. In these two plants, we can see we used the same key to create storage locations. Based on the assignment of purchase organization to company code and plant, we can classify three different types. First one is the plant specific purchasing organization, cross plant purchase organization. Third one is the cross company code purchasing organization. Plant specific purchase organization. In SAP, we must and should assign purchase organization to plant and assign purchase organization to company code is optional. In case of plant specific purchasing organization, 
we must and should assign purchase organization to plant and company code cross plant purchasing organization in this type of assignment we assign single purchase organization to multiple plants and here assignment of purchasing organization to plant is mandatory and assignment of purchase organization to company code is optional cross company code purchasing organization in this type of assignment purchasing organization we must and should assign purchase organization to plant and we must not assign purchase organization to any company code standard purchase organization is required for process where the system has to determine a purchase organization these processes are pipeline procurement consignment stock transfer and automatic creation of purchase order where posting goods received here one plant we can assign to only one standard purchase organization but one standard purchase organization can have multiple plants reference purchase organization is for reference for all other existing purchase organization and reference purchase organization is not assigned to any plant or company code the contract terms and conditions can be utilized by other purchase organizations for example contract which is created by reference purchase organization can be used by other purchase organization which is assigned to reference purchase organization in sap purchase group is not possible to assign any organization level purchase group is always client level this is the overall organization structure in sap ml let us see the organization structure on sap screen and now i am going to create the new organization structure in sap ml enter the t code spro press enter key click on sap reference img go to enterprise structure click on definition to create company code go to financial accounting now execute edit copy delete check company code double click on copy delete check company code click on copy object i am going to copy the company code from 1000 to za01 now click on write mark it is copying the gl account yes if you want to maintain the different local currency click on yes if you don't want to maintain the different local currency click on no click on write mark click on write mark it is going to copy the number ranges click on write mark yes so now click on create request option i am going to create new tr company code creation okay in the real time project to give the tr description we have the separate template so based on the template we need to give the short description okay click on save button click on write mark so now it's go going to copy the various data from different tables click on write mark click on s yes this press enter key this click on close copy yes enter this taking bit longer yes now creation of company code za01 is completed click on write mark now come back 
check the company code by double clicking on edit company code data click on position enter company code zd01 yes select this company code click on details yes it's copied everything if you want to check the address just click on the address icon yes address also copied from existing company code click on right mark now save it come back come back close it now we are going to create plant go to logistics general execute the define copy delete check plant double click on define plant or copy from existing plant i am going to copy from the plant from existing plant click on copying function i am going to copy from thousand plant that is zero one click on right mark yes click on right mark yes create new tr creation okay click on right click on save button click on right mark just press enter key yes now z01 plant is created come back now double click on the define plant check the our newly created plant z01 enter yes that is 01 plant is created successfully come back close it now we are going to create storage location Z01 storage location system creates automatically why because we are copied the plant from thousand plant click on right mark yes all the storage locations created from thousand plant come back now create the purchase organization just click on the new entry here no need to copy from the existing uh, uh, purchase organization click on there's zero one just give the description okay press enter key and save it i'm going to save the same tr come back come back okay now we can see the assignment part go to the assignment first we should assign plant to company code go to logistics general click on assign plant to company code click on new entries enter the company code za01 enter the plant za01 press enter key okay so why because uh, we are copied right so it's auto entry is automatically copied okay just come back enter the za01 okay it's uh just select it give the option and save it now click on new entries enter the company code za01 enter the plant za01 press enter key now save it come back come back okay now assign the purchase organization to company code and plant go to material management assign purchase organization to company code yeah just click here find the purchase organization za01 enter the company code za01 press enter key now save it click on right mark come back assign the purchase organization to plant execute click on new entries enter the purchase organization za01 enter the plant za01 press enter key now save it come back come back now assign the 
standard purchase organization to plant just click on execute button anyhow we have only one purchase organization and only one plant just click on the position enter the plant z is 01 yeah just to remove this thousand enter the purchase organization z is 01 press enter key now click on save button come back now assign purchase organization to reference purchase organization click on execute click on new entries enter the purchase organization z is 01 my reference purchase organization is c1 double zero okay press enter key now click on save button save it okay come back come back now we are going to create purchase group to create purchase group go to material management option yeah go to purchasing so here just execute the purchase group click on new entries okay so here I am going to create purchase group I am going to create purchase officer press enter key now click on save click on right mark yes uh, we are created the organization structure in SAP MM that's it today tutorial thank you